Ashmosi spills in a recent interview how she has gotten so famous, so popular within a short period of time in the entertainment space and why she is always favored by many people. Ashmosi spills that people want to associate with her and give her deals because she is pretty. Want to know the full deals? Just sit down, relax, and stay tuned. But before I commence with the full deals, welcome to Apricot DCV, a platform where we keep you updated and informed on any latest matters happening on social media. If you haven't already, do subscribe to our YouTube page. Don't forget to like, share, and turn on the notification bell to get notified when next we drop our next video. And don't forget to follow us on Facebook at Apricot DCV. So all our wonderful returning subscribers much love for me here thank you for your consistency and support we do not take you for granted now to all our viewers relax enjoy and stay tuned popular comedian and content creator amarachi amusi if you are into watching comedy skits on the net you should be really familiar with her because that is how she got her stardom amarachi is her real name but she goes by the name ashmusi Comedy skits was the one thing that made her found her space in the entertainment industry and after thriving massively in that, she has evolved into other lucrative businesses. Ashmusi, as she is very popularly known for, claims in a written interview that being beautiful and being extremely attractive has helped her land several agreements and business partnerships. She also went on to disclose that appearing nice had earned her favor on the Porsche Saturday's beat. Appearing nice indeed, but let's take a look at exactly what she said. Ashmosi said, Good looks favoring someone is a general thing. It's not just about the entertainment industry. Good looks have favored me. Some people want to associate with me or give me deals because I'm pretty, Ashmosi said. Ashmosi being a multi-millionaire, even a billionaire if I must say so myself because she is a CEO and owner of two extremely luscious companies that is gaining ground especially in the business world. World. Ashmosi has trended massively just a while back after she gifted two cars to her two most loyal staff. She then in this interview spoke on what had motivated her to give two cars to her most loyal staffs as Mushi said. First, one of the car is for my real estate staff and it is a company car. The second car was for a member of the staff of my beauty company. What motivated me to buy the car for her staff of the beauty company was because she had been with me since I started the business about about six years ago she has been loyal and active she deserves more than that it was a pleasure giving her that car Ashmusi in the interview also spoke on how being popular has impacted her life and gave instances of moments she wished she wasn't a popular figure. Ashmusi said, For instance, when I go out and I just want to have fun and do whatever I like, the fact that I am popular restricts me. I can't really be myself in certain places. I have to look a certain kind of way and talk in a certain kind of way. When I want to start a relationship, it is usually scary for me because i feel the guy may have a problem with me being popular i am usually anxious that i might lose the man when he gets to know i have many followers that actually scares off some men Ashmosi didn't stop there in the interview as she was prompted to speak on whether she gets pressured to get married by her family and others. Ashmosi said, marriage pressure is a thing generally and I am experiencing little from my family. My family members know how successful I am and how much I still want to achieve. They know I am doing great and they do not pressure me on marriage anymore. I pressure myself too sometimes though. It's not because I cannot wait to be with a man forever rather it is because i desire to have my own home and children there are so many points she made in this interview but first of all let's take a quick brief on how she spoke on because she is pretty and very well dressed that is why she gets plenty deals and why people favor her a lot in this entertainment industry well dressed quoi how please tell me because of that well dress you are not emphasizing enough on it you people should stop talking like as if you don't know you your life is basically on social media stop hiding or trying to say something that you are not 
that is the only thing i can say because i don't know why these celebrities make other people that are working hard look like though they are doing absolutely nothing someone will hear this and be like okay so it's dressed well go and spend a hell lot of money on clothes and they will not get the same result so stop beating around the bush and giving young people the impression that you made your fame money and everything that you own and have today because of you are well dressed now moving on to the part that she talked on how she gifted her staff a car because of her loyalty is something i feel like people should emulate these kind of things make other people make your workers work harder you know make them feel loved make them know that they have a family with you and their hard work is not just going to the garbage i saw the video myself and it was a really emotional video for the girl it was a really emotional scene and i feel like a lot of business owners should emulate these characters you don't have to buy a car you don't have to buy a lamborghini truck just something small as long as you can afford it and you give it with your heart it is really really important and it goes a long way in that person's life now talking about the part she was talking about marriage i feel like all these celebrities they are getting older and they know it they just want to hide they just want to make us believe that they are not feeling it they know that they are getting older and one day they want to marry and to see man to marry is the thing that they are looking for immediately they don't see a jackpot somebody that actually understands them somebody that can they can actually stay and cope with the kind of lifestyle that they have lived and the kind of fame an image they have built in for themselves in the social media space they'll be so happy to have such people in their life so guys hit us up in the comment section let us know what your thoughts opinions and contributions are we'd love to hear from you whatever you think do hit us up in the comment section provided for you down below and if you haven't guys what are you waiting for do subscribe to our youtube page as a proko gcv don't forget to like share and turn on your notification bell to get notified when next we drop our next video as you do not want to miss out on trendy juicy hot spicy latest topics happening on social media and while you're at that do head on to our facebook page and give us a quick follow as it inspires and motivates us to keep on pushing more insightful videos for your pleasure thank you all so so much for staying tuned with us up to this point once again as we've come to the end of today's segment like on your awareness guys do stay safe yeah some of you boat drivers really be giving me an ache because you're acting like you're the only ones affected by the fuel subsidy even the ones with apc flags in their car make it make sense now will you before the fuel subsidy you cannot book a ride without most of the drivers complaining and complaining i said they're the only ones affected by the fuel subsidy when at the end of the day we are all in this country you know that they have not increased minimum wage you know that people did not even get a raise in their salaries the same um fuel you use is the same fuel an uber driver uses the same fuel a taxi driver uses also there are businesses out there they have to run their generator from morning till night everybody is literally suffering protesting and asking for a 200 percent increment in fares does not entirely solve the problem and if i may add after the announcement of subsidy removal boat prices actually went up if you use boats you know if you don't never mind so you're telling me you want the app to increase their fares with a 200 percent increment but cut down commission to 50 percent the math is not matching such an unrealistic expectation because if i book a ride that is supposed to be a 2500 naira ride and it's 7000 naira i would rather enter keke or check other apps so you guys are going to lose customers have you thought of it think be only 200 percent increment on a for carry gun and dagger joint because some of you the way that which you beg you should be on the street with other beggars carrying a plate and to add both is the most expensive out of them all uber is even fair let me not even start with the stress and headache i have to go through to beg you to put on your air conditioner for us to enjoy for the duration i am paying for i'm paying for comfort but a lot of you know your air conditioners are bad but you still come like that to pick up a client without first telling them let me not even start with how some of you smell and fat inside your car because we know me i know if you do pass myself and with the way it be now it will be from boat to along and with that being said bye